beautiful flowers and welcome back. Today's video is a Kim Possible look. I will be trying to do a Kim Possible look since I just recently um, dyed my hair. I know it's not, you know, that orange right now, but later on it will get orange. But I thought, why not do a Kim Possible look? And so I even got like a black like turtleneck going on and I thought, well, why not? Please don't forget to like and subscribe, it would mean a lot. So without further ado, let's just jump right in. So, I already have my base on, I did foundation. I didn't put any concealer on because I, I, Kim Possible is more like plain looking, but of course we're gonna, you know, add some dimension and I don't wanna look so, you know. So, I don't wanna look, you know, too plain. So, Let's start with some, some bronzer contour just to give the cheeks some, some color. I'll be using the, um, the big Morphe palette, the 39A. Look how big this is. This here, I'll be using the lightest shade, which is this one here, just to add some color to the cheeks. I'm not going to put a lot. Make sure you tap it off. And then I'll just be putting it here. Focusing it mainly near my temple. Like so. And then bringing it up a little bit up here. And same on the other side. Same idea. Here, maybe a bit on the forehead, as you can see, like so. And put a lot, I don't usually put a lot. Kim is gonna look very um, plain because she doesn't usually wear a lot of makeup. But I'm using, I'm doing like a modern Kim Possible look, maybe, I'm not sure. So I'm using the Milk Blush, I got the mini one. And I'm just putting it on my fingers, warming it up, and I'm just gonna tap it in. I'm giving her like a blush look. I'm just lightly going to tap it in, like so. Giving her a rosy look. Can you even go in with the beauty blender? Blend it out some more. Like so. Just like that. Same on the other side. If you guys don't like your, using your fingers, you could just, you know, put it on, but I'm not really that much of a fan. I just believe, like, it'll put more pigment than it should. And just lightly tapping where I want it. Like so. It is easier if you don't set your face first, if you're using creams, that you don't set your face first and then put this on because then it gets like really weird and patchy. So I haven't used powder on my face just yet. Like so. And then a bit on the nose. Trying to emphasize small small nose like so there we go now I'm also going to use another blush just to make sure it doesn't move I'm using them the bitty bitty color pop one in the shade simply sweet I'm just gonna use the same fluffy brush just to set it in place, as you can see. I say that a lot, I say it as you can see a lot. And done. Now, let's move on to the eyes. So, I'm not going to do uh, anything.
nothing drastic. I'm just gonna define my eyes just a little bit using a fluffy brush. And I'm gonna use the Glowing Coconuts palette because it's my favorite. And I'm gonna use the shade Shalia just to define my crease and add some some color. Nothing, nothing drastic. Just a little bit. Make sure to tap it off and just in the inner corner. In the inner corner, just on the crease. Just to add some. Color. Now my eyes are already primed with um, the foundation that I use. I use the the e.l.f. foundation in the shade. I'm not sure what shade. In the shade light ivory. It's this one. And then just, just like that, just so it could define my eyes a little bit. Like so. Like that. Very simple, very easy. I think Kim Possible is the most easiest look to do maybe, but I I believe other people will like go the extra mile, but this is my interpretation of Kim Possible making it very very simple. And next is mascara. I'm going to do a light coat of mascara using the Snapscara by Maybelline. Very lightly. Simple. And using upstrokes. only has like her upper um, lip done and I thought I'd do um, just the upper lip and then lightly add some co color on the bottom just so I don't look too weird and I'm going to use the Colourpop tint in Chaco just do the upper lip It's a perfect shade color for the Kim Possible look. Like so. And just lightly tap it so it doesn't look too weird. Like so, and that is my Kim Possible look. Very short and simple, straight to the point. I I don't recommend you guys doing it, or if you want, you can, but it's very easy. It's my interpretation of, you know, Kim Possible. But I thought, why not? Because it's Christmas Day, I have nothing else to do. And by the way, guys, happy holidays. But that would be it. That's That's my... My look, very simple if Kim Possible. Please like and subscribe again. It mean a lot. And I was thinking maybe I should do other Disney characters in my interpretation. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, that is all. Thank you guys. Bye.